Arkansas Razorbacks, and here we go. Miller at the goal line. And he is brought down out across there for the third down play. Nutt unloads it, and he completes it to Edmonds, and Edmonds has the first down with plenty to spare going up near the midfield stripe, about a yard short of the midfield, 28-yard line of the Aggies. First down. Nutt throwing, Nutt completing to Shebest. And Shebest is knocked off his feet after he gets... 46-yard effort, hash mark to the left. Villarreal has plenty of distance, and he also has it right through the uprights, and the Razorbacks take the lead. So with 8 minutes, 39 seconds to go in the first quarter, the Razorbacks jump ahead on that field goal by Villarreal by a score of 3 to nothing, and we'll return to Razorback Stadium in Fayetteville with more exciting Southwest Conference football action. 24-yard line of the Aggies. Little play action and a roll by Stump, throwing on first down, completed to Jeff Nelson. Nelson fumbles the football, red shirts are after it, and who's got it? Arkansas. Nelson had taken that pass out across the 40 for a big gainer, and, then, and consequently are four and four for the year. Danny Nutt dropping and throwing back over the middle, completed to Shebus, and he was is hit. Second and goal. Miller, touchdown Arkansas. Carl Miller from Pine Bluff, the junior. From Dollarway High School, scores for the Razorbacks. Fayetteville, second down call coming up for the Aggies. Fumble by Thomas Sanders, and the Razorbacks have it as David Basil, 53, the strong linebacker, is on the ball. Teal and Nelson are the wideouts for the Aggies on a second down call. It is Tony, and Tony is brought down on the 15 by Raven Cole. Third down. Stump throwing over the middle. It is picked off. It is intercepted by number two, Kevin Anderson. And Anderson is still on his feet at the 20 and finally goes down at the 19-yard line. His fourth interception of the year and a 13-yard return. And the Aggies have given the ball up. Villarreal. Plenty of distance, plenty of height, plenty of foot. Three more points on the board for Arkansas. 12 minutes and 13 seconds to go in the first half. And the Razorbacks are leading A&M by a score of 13 to nothing. And we'll return to Fayetteville right after this. Four seconds. And he gets that play underway. Stump going for the touchdown. Teal is out there, but the pass is intercepted. Picked off by Kevin Wyatt in the end zone. Well, he said oh, it wasn't. Oh, <laughs> he just missed the end zone. He's on the one-foot mark just outside the end zone. Coming up. Danny Nutt running the offense. And on the pitch, a fumble. Who's got it? It appears like the Aggies. So the Aggies, after coughing the ball up, hash mark left. Plenty of foot of that ball, but it is off to the left side. So Alan Smith fails to put the Aggies on the board. So many AM turnovers. Now Arkansas at the 20 as Nutt fires to Edmonds coming out of the backfield of the 30 first down and more he is knocked out of bounds at about the 36 yard line by Darrell about a yard and a half you look at those third down conversions and Arkansas has been converting them coughs the ball up Childers grabs it right out of the air Ray Childress flag goes down as he is down on the 40 yard line Ranger backs at their own 34 Thomas Edmonds and Van Dyke are in the backfield and Nuts going to go upstairs again throwing to Chivas and he has the first down at the 48-yard line. Hash mark right. Villarreal has it blocked. A&M goes scrambling after the football. And it's Polk who recovered it at about the 39-yard line. The block of the kick. With maybe one play and Stump is sacked. Stump is brought down as the clock runs out as Gerald Jones, number 76, the junior from Cabot, Arkansas, sacked him to win the first half. So the Arkansas Razorbacks taking advantage of turnovers by Texas A&M, leading the Aggies by 13 to nothing at halftime. We'll be back with the halftime activities. Are now in that wishbone. Nut lost it out there, just caught by Miller. Miller up the sideline is bounced out of bounds. On the 36 after picking up the first three seconds, two seconds they do. Nutt will throw it and does. Was it trapped or was it caught? And we will have a decision as James Shebus, number 25, 
went for the ball and apparently took it right off the turf before it hit the turf. Todd Schantz is back to kick. The sophomore from Richardson will kick it away to Bobby Joe Edmonds. Edmonds uh, will not fair catch the ball, and here comes Edmonds on the return. He's got one man to beat, the kicker. And Schantz gets it out of bounds inside the 10 yard line. Daryl Smith coming down. Yeah, that had excellent balance, though, of the pass and the run. Third down goal to go, and Foreman goes in for the touchdown. Marshall Foreman scoring his seventh touchdown of the year, and Arkansas jumped out in front now with seven minutes and 39 seconds to go in the third quarter by a score of 19 to nothing. Three plays, minute 13. Two-point conversion attempt is caught down to the end zone. A great catch by Bobby Joe Edmonds for two points. So now Arkansas makes it 21 to nothing with seven minutes and 36 seconds left to go in the third quarter. Bobby Joe Edmonds. Right now the crowd is rather sparse, and as you look on the field, you can understand why. Fumble, and Arkansas, I believe, recovers. David Basil, the linebacker, popped right down on that ball, and it's been a very frustrating afternoon. The announcers for this game were approved of the Southwest Athletic Conference. Third and two, first down and more. Edmonds on his way down to about the 15-yard line. And Lance Jackson spotted. Andy Upchurch is up over the ball. He is the center. Nut going to Derek Thomas, the fullback. And Thomas, look at this powerful 217-pounder out of Paducah, Kentucky. Get inside right and stay in. Luther Franklin, 82, left side. Eddie White, 28, right side. And it is a touchdown for Daryl Thomas. Derek Thomas, rather. Derek Thomas just kept going at the one he was hit. Asbury couldn't contain him. And Thomas gets in for his third touchdown of the year. The uh, Harbor Freeway. And now Major in trouble. And I believe that's a fumble. I don't know if the ball went forward or whether... He says that it was a fumbled pass. The ball did not go forward. So that's a lateral pass. Free ball. And first down. Major, the left-hander. Fires away. Nelson can't hold it. Oh, did he take a hit by Charles Washington? Times they had it. They made it a long afternoon. John Major, the quarterback. And Ricky Williams, 15 here. It is first down. And Tony and Bernstein are now in the backfield, and a fumble will turn the ball over. Well, that's the kind of fumble that just drives you crazy. Because you are with the Hogs are leading 28 to nothing. a and in possession at the 33-yard line of the Aggies. Handoff going to Rod Bernstein, and Bernstein is... If you look at the stands now, you'd say, where are they? Well, the rain never stopped after beginning before the game got underway. Thomas breaking a tackle, and Thomas a first down and more out of bounds at about the 24. Chased up by Terrence. First down for Thomas and Arkansas. And Thomas keeps it again. Thomas inside the 15 to the 14. He may have another first down. Operation. 